Hey guys, Jason Nedved here with Nedved Precision Shooting. Uh, we got another stage here for the NRL 22 July Course of Fire, a Battle at Bunker Hill. So for this one, you're going to be from far to near, then near to far when you move to the next tip. And it says the tip is defined by the very tip of the leg. Um, I don't know why they need to put that in there. I've never tried to game that. Uh, so it's apparently someone did something. So the biggest thing here is making sure you got your dope card written out to where you can understand it, shooting from far to near, or whatever, however you need to write that down. Um, holdovers only. So I just have mine locked at zero. Windage is locked, elevation's locked, so I don't go and uh, change my elevation because obviously it's very much of a habit. You shoot, you move to a different target, you dial. So I just lock them so I don't have that mistake. Um, it's just going to be holding for the wind and the uh, elevation and working our way in and then back out. I got a two tenths reticle in here, so hopefully we can um, dial this three tenths, six tenths, 1.1. Hopefully we can get pretty accurate with that. So again, I'm just using my Schmedium heavy fill with the Gray Ops Pro Plate with the brass weights. Got the rifle all nice and balanced. Give us a call if you need help with that. And we'll get started here. Time begins now. So we get that nice flat surface going at the far one. Need to hold over. We can mess with parallax, thank goodness. And this is going to be 1.7. Right there. Oh, I forgot to hold over. You see, I hit the edge there. Then 1.1. There. 0.6. So we got the reticle there, easy. Three tenths on this one. So you can see the two and the four. Nice and easy, this one's gonna be zero. Then make sure our action's open. Move to the other tip, and then we're gonna go near to far. We're gonna hold over a little bit more wind on that far one, huh? A little blurry. Dad ran that one over with the tractor, that's why it moves so much. Uh, three tenths. Six tenths on one, two, three, this one. And then this one's gonna be 1.1. 1 .1. Then we got 1.7, and we gotta hold more wind, obviously. And that's all there is to it. So 35 seconds left. Uh, went just fine. Uh, just going up and down the dope card here. I'll see if I can't get you guys to see that. How I write mine out. I just got the yardages there and then going near to far. So I just write it backwards. So I just open up my left eye and then I read that uh, as I'm shooting. Um, that's why I had to recount the targets because I was looking at my dope and I just wanted to make sure I was on the right target. So not too bad. I love the tank trap. Mine's really high. You know, if you got smaller ones, might be a little bit more wobbly. I know the one in Watertown is really wobbly, especially with a 20-some pound gun on it, 7-pound schmedium. Uh, it gets a little heavy. But uh, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know. Like, share the video, you know, all that good stuff. I do appreciate it. Thanks, guys.